Hey guys, it's Matchless here, and today we have some new LEGO Ninjago Movie minifigures revealed from the Collectible Minifigure series. These were revealed by LEGO on Twitter, and the names are as follows. Volcano Garmadon, Master Wu, Spinjutsu Training Nia, and Lloyd Garmadon. Sushi Chef, Misako, Jay Walker, Shark Army Great White, Shark Army General Number 1, and Gong and Guitar Rocker. None of these names are really all that interesting, or I think the most interesting out of all of these figures has to be Garmadon just because of his printing. The Lloyd figure is pretty cool because I like that hood mold that they've done, but I really think the Garmadon one's got the most interesting thing here. He also appears to have the bowl and the spoon, which is similar to Lloyd, which is interesting. Master Wu's kind of generic, but I do like the, corn the cornflake thing he has. Spinjutsu Training Nia is a little bit of just a continuation of this whole Spinjutsu Training line they're doing with figures that have that same torso, but it's nice to be able to get her hairpiece in such a small little thing, as well as those brown katanas. Sushi Chef is okay, he's, you know, he's not that crazy, he's got some cool stuff in there though, I like that sushi piece he comes with, I like his printing, I, I the dual mode legs look really good to me, uh, he's overall okay, not one of my favorites, but he's, he's nice to have. Misako. Misako is an interesting one because this is going to be an easy way to get Misako, which is good. Misako has that new hairpiece, but this adaption of her is still weird. I also like that purse that she has. That looks pretty good. Jay Walker, you know, first and last name. He looks pretty good. I like that he has the selfie stick, which is kind of funny, and that has the printing of him on it, which I find kind of hilarious. We, we get the hairpiece, which is going to be really important for some people. Because that hairpiece is really sought after, so it's really nice to be able to get that hairpiece in such a small set. Shark Army Great White is really, really cool to me. Uh, he might actually be my favorite. I know I said uh, Garmin was cool, but uh, I think this one's actually pretty good. I like how he has, I guess he's got no battery left, or he's got like critical low mass there. So that's going to be uh, interesting to see how that actually plays out in the movie with the whole battery thing. Uh, but the printing's really cool, and I love the black along with the lava detail. It just looks really cool to me. Then we have... Then we have Shark Army General number one. She's got some cool stuff in there. I like the whole thing she's got going on in the back. She did... I mean, we've seen her before, or at least something similar in the sticker book. And it's pretty nice to have her as a minifigure. She has that milkshake piece, which I actually really like. That's something kind of cool to have there. And lastly, there's uh, probably the, the, the worst one here. It's... I don't care at all. It's, um the guitar and gong guy he's whatever i like his guitar piece but eh, that's that's pretty much all he has for me and yeah that's pretty much it for this little analysis here you can see on the packaging there actually is one minifigure that uh we haven't seen which is that girl with the pink hair so that'll be interesting to see when we actually get official pictures of that probably tomorrow but that's pretty much it thank you guys for watching until next time i'll see you guys later